There isn't one type of student that's an honors student. I think honors college students tend to be more serious about their academics in general. But especially, I think, honors college students are often a little more open-minded about pursuing questions, investigating areas of study that are not necessarily related to what they want to do or not exclusively related to what they want to do in terms of career. They might just be questions that the student feels are important questions that every person should be asking. Students can now select, yes, I want to be considered for the Honors College at Boise State when they're doing their regular application for admission to the university. I think it makes it very easy to decide, yes, this is something I'm interested in. The fact that we are now a Carnegie Doctoral University with high research activity draws students because they recognize the Boise State name and brand. I chose to teach in the Honors College because I like the excitement, the, the, uh, the zeal that a lot of Honors College students bring to their classes. I think the Honors College has uh, improved the quality of experience here at uh, BSU. Most of the classes that I've taken here are better as far as student interaction with the professor and the actual content itself. It's so competitive and there's so many more people. Having that early uh, registration really, really, really helps. One of the benefits is surrounding yourselves with some of the best minds at the university among the student body. I think having that group of sharp minds around an individual student is an opportunity to step up his or her game and uh, be surrounded by people that might challenge and encourage the person to do uh, that student's best academically. I feel that on the whole, the Boise State University Honors Program is really strong. Very good classes and students who are selected from the university to be excellent in academic rigor. Honor students tend to be really proactive even before they get to college. Being able to offer sort of the one-on-one -on -one support that we do now and really making it a personal experience for students is what we care about. About 22% of our population is from an underrepresented group, whether that's um, first-generation student, Pell eligible student, a student that identifies as an ethnic minority, for example. Um, so we have a pretty diverse population already. And if you're interested in the Honors College, we're interested in you. We want to hear from you. We want to learn about you. We want to know more about you. And the Honors College is open to you. So please feel free to come talk to us. Stop in if you're walking by the building. We really want to hear from you. Thank you.